Hello fellow travelers. Today is Wednesday, February 4th, 2009. It is week four of my weight loss project. I am still not able to exercise due to back pain. Um, I do have a doctor's appointment scheduled in about two weeks, as soon as one I could get, but I'm still watching what I eat. So, very exciting. Um, in the meantime, I've been reading books to try to get me psyched about losing weight during the stagnant time period because I am up one pound though all of my inches are the same. So I have been reading the rest of this book here, the Body Esteem book which I mentioned before by Sherry Dawson and she actually sent me the missing CD, the one that I had that was cracked. She sent me a new one. Um, so that's really cool and the CDs are very nice. I like them a lot. I like listening to stuff while I'm doing other projects and so it's a really good book that allows me to do that while I'm reading or working on the uh, worksheets in the book. I also ordered and received this book here. It's called Reprogramming the Overweight Mind, Seven Steps to Taking Control of Your Subconscious. And this is by Kelly Burris. And this one also comes with a CD, because I love my CDs. And I haven't started this one yet. It's on my list after I finish The Body Esteem. But I am reading another book while I'm reading the um, Body Esteem book, and that is this one here, which is self-hypnosis diet and that's by Steven Gurjevich and Joy Gurjevich um, and their PH one's a PhD I don't, I don't know if his wife is or not um, or his daughter I didn't read the intro on that one I just dove right into the book um, uh, in addition to those books I've been listening to the CDs that come with them um, that are basically hypnosis, which is kind of nice. You just stick your earplugs in and get to tune everything out. It's really great when you get to do that at work. Um, I have a job where I don't have a whole lot to do most of the time. I do some cleaning and, and I'm there in case the kids wake up. But uh, for the most part, I don't have to do any heavy lifting or paperwork stuff um, that I don't get done earlier in the night. Um, so I've been listening to the CDs. This is one of the ones that came with Body Esteem, and it's got some meditations on it. Um, this is the one I listen to when I'm going to sleep, although the first track it says you can listen to while you're reading or walking or whatever you're doing. It's subliminal messages, so there's really pretty music with chimes and... I don't know. It's got theta waves, which are meditation intuitive and memory. Um, so I guess that's supposed to correlate with some brainwave. Uh, and it's really nice. I like it a lot. Even Raymond listens to it when I'm not home. We just keep it running all the time. People are constantly coming in our house and going, what is that CD? I really like it. So now you know. It's Kelly Howell. Um, weight loss, subliminal reprogramming. We also have her um, The Secret Meditation one as well where you can actually hear her voice in that one and that one also people ask a lot what one that one is universal mind meditation um, so that's pretty much that anyway besides the reading um, it's Wednesday and Wednesday is fill the vitamin box Woo! so I've been filling my vitamins I only take the special vitamin D pill that's a prescription once a week and that's on Wednesdays which is why we fill the box on Wednesdays. Um, in addition to that, I take um, many other vitamins that make me very nauseous and I have to take saltines with them. Um, and that's mostly because with the surgery that I had, I can become malabsorptive, which means I have to up my vitamin intake, which you know, you should be taking a multivitamin anyway, but in addition to a multivitamin, and I have to take a chewable, sorry if I'm talking too fast, um, I have this one here. It's a children's vitamin, but it's an adult-sized portion, so I don't have to cut the pill in half in order to take it. Where if you were a kid under the age of 12, you would need to cut this pill in half. I even get the fun little cartoon character uh, animals, I guess is what it is, although I can't tell what they are. 
So in addition to that, I take this one, Fiber Choice. Yay! Everybody knows what fiber does for you, right? Right. Um, I also have to take a women's calcium vitamin. I take Viactive. Very tasty. It's the only one I actually look forward to taking. Um, and my vitamin D pill is not out here, but I take that one. And then, just for the hell of it, to see if it helps at all, I've been taking this one. It's supposed to work specifically for women, although it's not FDA approved or something like that, or the FDA doesn't acknowledge that it works or it doesn't work. So, those are what I've been taking. Um, so I fill up my little box, and because I can't swallow anything larger than an M&M, I have a pill cutter. How uh, nursing home am I? Woohoo! Yeah, but at least they're vitamins and not medications. I think I mentioned in my last vlog that I am off all of my medications. Very, very exciting. No more medications whatsoever, and my risk of diabetes is way, way low. Very cool, especially because it runs in my family. Anyway, that's pretty much it for this week. The only other thing I've been doing is reading about stuff on my honeymoon. These are the quick books that I can read. The Unofficial Guide to Walt Disney World, 2009. And Walt Disney World for Adults, the 2009 version. So I can quickly read little factoids about it to help me stay excited about that. Wedding plans are insane as always, but starting to come together. We got the groomsmen's gifts in the mail, so we're oogling those, and our centerpieces came in the mail, and the favors are here, and the invitations are stuffed, and everything's ready to go. Very exciting. Anyway, I'm pretty much done for this week. I'll see you all next week. Happy trails.